Welcome to today's video where we're going to test all the cachava flavors minus chocolate. And why not chocolate, you ask? Well, first, great question. Thank you for asking. Well, the reason we're going to do chocolate is because that is all we've ever drank. We have went through so much chocolate in this household. The kids absolutely love it. I've talked about it in other videos. That is a gold star. You know it's good. Everybody in the comments on my videos loves it. So if chocolate is something you're looking to learn about, thumbs up on chocolate. But we're going to test the other flavors because outside of vanilla, they're all a little newer. They wanted to help you make a more informed decision if you're looking to pick the right flavor for you. Now, as far as how this video is going to work, I'm going to introduce a testing panel. They have never had this before, so they're going to test it and give you their real-time thoughts. And then I'll jump in, summarize what they thought, and also give you my take. So you'll have a lot of viewpoints to hopefully help you make the best decision for you. But let's go ahead and introduce this testing panel. Introducing our first cachava tester, Delaney. 10 years old, agreeable, willing to eat anything, unless it includes the colors green, yellow, or red, has a bad texture, or smells funny. Cachava. You got some work cut out for you. Next up, at seven years old, Tegan, a kid who loves healthy food. Salad? Yes, please. Dressing on that salad? No way. He only needs the greens. His taste buds are tuned to know exactly what nutritious food should taste like. Cachaba, this will not be an easy test. And our final tester, at five years old, Many say he is the toughest of critics ever to roam these parts. Taste buds, who needs them? Known for his signature line, that looks yucky. I am not eating it. Kachaba, I hope these shakes look good for your sake. Fuck my. Wait, do it, does it? All right, Rowan, what do you think of this one? <laughs> it's cool. You like it a lot? No, no, much more. Way more than a little? Yep. All right, Tegan, yours is already gone, but can you tell us what you thought? The best. All right, and this is the first time you guys have ever had this, right? <laughs> good, but I don't really like sweet things, and it was kind of sweet. It's a little sweet for you? All right, good feedback. All right, will you guys drink this again? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Are you going to ask for more as soon as this video is over? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Okay. All right. You ready to try a new flavor? Yeah. Vanilla. Now, as far as my kids go, they all loved it. My daughter did say it was a little bit sweet, and the other two absolutely loved it. It was their favorite. As far as my side goes, I'm a chocolate person. And so I've never tried this. I have had tons of the chocolate cachava, never given this shot, and just assumed I wouldn't like it at all because it's not really my thing. And I'm sitting here drinking it right now. And it's fantastic. And that's a strong statement because I usually don't lean towards the vanilla side of things, but this stuff is really good. Now, as far as the flavor goes, I wouldn't describe it so much as a true vanilla. Like if you just want a straight vanilla, it's almost like vanilla cake, if that makes sense. It's just like you had a really rich, strong vanilla cake and that taste put into a shake. That's what it's like to me. And I think it is very, very good. I am thoroughly enjoying this and I might just have to start getting some of this as well as a chocolate because it's very good. I really enjoyed it. And I do hope you're finding this video beneficial, informational, or just a little fun, maybe getting a smile out of it. And if you are, the one thing I ask, you know it, please hit that like button. It helps us out so much here and we really, really appreciate it. Right. Let us know what you think. This one is a good one. The flavor, I don't really like, but um, like after I like swallow it, there's a little bit more in my mouth, and that has a taste that I like for some reason. An aftertaste? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's called an aftertaste. It's the best that I've tried so far out of the vanilla, chocolate, and the this. You rank this even above chocolate. Above the chocolate. Holy smokes. It's like if you were to go into this patch of berries. Take blueberries, blackberries, and you just picked a ton of them, blended them up, and added a little bit of like cocoa powder. This is what you would get. It's like so fresh and yummy. Mm, good feedback. Coconut acai. So as far as the kids go, my daughter absolutely loved it. She moved it right to the top of her list and said it's her favorite of all of them. My youngest loved it as well, and my middle said not his thing. As far as me, 
I've been sitting here drinking this for about five minutes, trying to come up with the words to describe it because it's a little tricky. And the flavor profile, how I would describe it, is yeah, it has a small bit of coconut flavor. Um, it has a light berry flavor, almost like a vanilla hint. And then, and I don't know if this will make any sense, but if you smell flowers and if you try to associate that to a taste, almost like that's in there. And the word I'll use to describe this is subtle. If you've ever had those like berry, berry drinks where it's just supposed to blast you in the face and just overpowering berry sweetness taste, this is not that. It is subtle. It's got sweetness, but not too much. It's got berry, but not too much. And then it's got those other flavor profiles mixed in that I told you about that just gives it a nice, subtle, easy to drink, you know, not too much type flavor profile. But then it does have a berry aftertaste as well. So all in all, I think it's very enjoyable. And I think most people would probably very much enjoy this, especially if that's the type of flavor profile you would enjoy. But I got nothing bad to say about it. It's good. I don't like the aftertaste. What do you think of this one's taste, Rowan? Kind of like good, but I don't like a sour myself. And Delaney? It's your thoughts good. on the chai? I really, really, really enjoy the cinnamon. It's like mostly cinnamon, but it's like if you were to get cinnamon and mix it with like something that's really sweet, that's what it would be. Like it, the cinnamon's good, but sweet, like really high. So Travis from the future here, and it's actually been nine days since we recorded the taste testing part. And I asked the kids a couple days ago to rank the flavors. And their answers really surprised me. And we got talking about it a little bit. And I had to re-record a couple parts of this video because of what they said. Now to start with the chai side of things, I thought they were all gonna hate it, just to be honest. It's chai, it's not berry berry, it's not chocolate. It's just not really a kid flavor. And each and every one of them said they liked it and they would drink it again. They didn't rank it at the top but they said they enjoyed it when drinking again. And I think that goes a lot to saying how good of a job Kachava did with that flavor. Now from my end, I think it's good. Um, chai is not really my thing, so I probably wouldn't order it again, but it has a really good cinnamon and spice type taste, it has that chai built into it. And overall, as far as a flavor profile goes, it's really good. And I think people that like chai would really enjoy it. I did ask my wife, cause she likes that flavor more than me. And she said it was really good. So that had that going for it. But in short, I think most people that like chai and like that kind of flavor are really gonna like the chai flavor of cachava. So hopefully that helps you out there. And to wrap up this video, I asked my kids to rank all the flavors and it led to one big takeaway. Now my daughter and my seven year old ranked completely the opposite. They had the complete opposite answers. My youngest, he was adamant that everyone was number one. And I'll be honest with you, I tried to do the parent thing and said, well, if you had these two, which one would you pick? Or didn't you like this one a little bit better? And he was like, nope, I'm shutting you down. I like them all the best. They're amazing. They're all number one. I'm not changing my answer. Stop it, dad. And this leads me to my takeaway. And that's that the kids liked all the flavors with the exception of my middle son. He didn't like the coconut acai. Outside of that, they all said all the flavors are fantastic. And this just leads to how good of a job Kachava did with building all these different flavors and making them enjoyable and some that even kids would enjoy. And if that's the case, I assume most adults are gonna like them. And what I take away from this is that you don't have to worry about, oh, some of these are probably gonna be bad, some will be good. They're all good and you just get to pick the one that you think will appeal to you the most because they are all enjoyable. And so I'll just wrap this up by saying they did a really good job and I think most people are gonna enjoy whatever flavor they decide to go with. But if you did take anything away from this, please hit that like button, subscribe to stay on top of everything where health technology meet. And until next time, here's to a healthier you and have a good one. Okay, people, there is a chance of a hurricane, only 50%. <laughs> <laughs>